What is going on guys? We are back on another episode of DC Bronzies. I'm Tyler. If you were new, go hit that subscribe button. We are gonna be hitting 1K. Well, we're gonna be hitting 500 soon. And the next goal is 1K. Thank you guys so much for helping me out. Um, today, we're back on the river. Got some tip ups set out. Already had some northern. And we're gonna try to get on some panfish as well. Um, I'm with my dad today. And um, we're gonna see who's gonna catch more fish. Alright guys, first fish, other than, oh it's a crappy too. Nice. Ah, get him. Nice first pan fish of the day. Only keeping crappies today along with big bluegills. So that was the first one. Very nice looking crappie. He just came up and ate that black and pink jig with that pink plastic. So we're going to put this one in the frying pan tonight. Alright guys, dad just got this bluegill. Like I said, we're only keeping 8 inch bluegills or crappies. It's an 8 incher and I'm going to throw them right in the bucket. Oh, I had one dad. I felt a tick, but he was, he was above me. Yeah. I, and I was looking at the one below, I felt a tick, but I just left it and I started pulling up and there was pressure and I accidentally pulled it out of his mouth. Oh, that was definitely a bluegill. Dang it. I didn't think anyone had it because I didn't see that one below me nearby. Alright guys, just had this flag go up. Not seen it move yet. Oh, there we go. Oh, he might have dropped it. Oh, he stole the minnow. Snagged us. Uh oh. No, he's there. I'm just waiting to crank him. Ready? Oh. He picked me clean. That is a good looking bluegill. Nice. I love when they have that purple and orange on them. Yeah. That looks so cool. Nice fish, guys. I ticked that one off. I brought it below him and I shot it up above and he came Thank all the way up, but then he started to disappear. <laughs> Alright, guys. Third keeper of the day. Not a bad fish. I'm trying to get on some, but they're still pretty picky. There we go. Are you kidding me? That was a bite like a crappie. Oh, for sure. Super tiny bluegill. All right, guys. Another small one. Not that small, he's probably a keeper. I'll check if he's around eight. Yeah, about eight inches. It's keepable. 
Yeah, there we go. All right, guys. We don't have the mic on the camera. Just got out, got all set up. We got a decent load in there. Not a bad fish. Thing took out so much line. Bunch of weeds tangled on here. That is the first one of the morning. Actually, second. Oh yeah, the second. Oh. We did have one before when I was setting up. He hit it. Actually, it's not as big as I thought, but look at how much line he took out. Yeah. He was spinning so quick when I got here. Yeah, that's a nice fish. Yeah, I'm gonna eat the players in this one. Followed the minnow as it was in his it was in his throat and it's gone now. Uh. He completely swallowed it as he was sitting in the water here. Dang. Let's send this this big guy back. Not bad fish. There he goes. Thank you. Oh, that's a good looking one, though. Real good looking one. Show the camera that one. That looks awesome. What a fish. Just on that small tungsten jig with a wax ring. Fortunately, these guys are kind of small. We've got a couple keepers out of here, but we're going to send him back. I don't even know how there's any wax from left down there. I got one to come up to six feet. There we go. Feels a little bit better. Better, but not good, not good enough to keep. Nice gill. Also gonna send that guy back. 